Hey everyone, this is Just to Tech and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I will show you how you can bypass the iCloud activation lock screen with the SIM working. Along with that, we will discuss about the new tool update that is the HFZ Universal Activator 3.0. If you have joined my Telegram group or channel, you already know about this update as yesterday I have already posted about this new update there. So if you want faster update, you can join my Telegram group also. So we will see step by step everything in this video with the practice practical process so first you need to download the hfz universal latest version 3 so you will require the mac as it's a mac tool and if you are a windows user you can try the hackintosh method now this is the new update in that they have fixed some new features like they added the signal with the ios 15 support so if you have a device that is working on the latest ios 15.7.3 down to the ios 15 you can use this tool and get the signals and the supported devices is iphone 6s iphone 7 7 plus 8 8 plus and iphone 8 and the other ipad models that is supported by the checkmate exploit so i will just put it all the model list on the screen so you can pause the video and read it out now open the tool first connect your device if you see waiting for the device just reopen the tool after that you will see the activate button and sim lock checker that means you can instantly check the sim lock status of your device from the tool if your device is sim unlocked that means you can easily bypass it with the sim but if your device is sim locked carrier locked or blacklisted that means your device is not eligible to bypass with the sim so you need to check these settings before you doing the bypass or registration so firstly you need to register your serial number so copy the serial number from the tool after that you can contact me with your serial number and the model name and i will register your device instantly you can go to my blog and you will get all my official social media handle links or you can check out the description you will get the direct links there you can contact me on my personal telegram and for the prices according to the model list i will put it on the screen so you can read it out once your device is registered you are ready to bypass after that simply connect your device again and click on the activate button now wait for the 5 to 10 seconds it will process the request now next it will open this kind of window with some instruction so next you need to put your device into the dfu mode so you can press the button combination according to your device Now next wait for some second and you will see the Apple logo and after that you will see the Warbus booting and the RAM disk and just like the check screen it will load the Pongo S on the device. Once it will load it will go to the hello screen again. Now once your device is on again on this screen, you have to press the OK button on that tool. Once you will do that, you will see the activation is ready. So it will take around 5 to 10 seconds. You can click on the OK button and you will see after that it will proceed. Now you can see we are getting the activation is ready. So you can click on OK. Now you will get the waiting for the device or you will get the activate device. Now click on that button. Now wait for 5 to 10 seconds again. It will process the request. Do not close the tool or disconnect the device. It will take 5 to 10 seconds to complete the activation. Once you will see the quick respring on your device, that means it's proceeding. So now you can see my device get the quick respring. After that, it will restart the device in order to complete the bypass. Now you can see that on the tool also we are seeing the activation bypass is successfully done. Now just wait for your device to complete on. So now you can see the device is on and straight on the home screen and everything looks good. Now the device is successfully bypassed and you can see there is no apple id bound in the settings so let me just connect with the wi-fi first and this is the complete bypass so if you reboot the device it will not lock again it's an untethered bypass with the cellular sim working and other i services working also so let me just reboot the device and show you 
so you can see that the device is working again after the reboot so now let's see the other i services that is working like iCloud login facetime siri app store like all the i services will work like a normal device So you can see that the iCloud login is working. Let's try out the other i services like FaceTime, Siri, App Store. Now you can check out the FaceTime is also working. Now everything looks good till now. Let's try out the other SIM services. Let me just insert my SIM card and see the cellular is coming or not. Now wait for the signals to appear on the top. And if it's not coming for the first time and if you see the no services, just restart your device. After that the network and signal will take update so everything will work. So now my sim is detected so let's place a call and see the calling is working. Now everything looks good. So finally let me just reboot the device again and show you all the things that are working. After the reboot also all the things will work. So now you can see that after the reboot everything looks good and working, the FaceTime is working, the iCloud login, also you can use the app store to download the apps. So everything will work in this bypass as it's a full bypass with the activation record. So network will work and all the i services also. So that's how you can use the latest HFZ universal activator version free. You can try this method and easily do the bypass on the iOS 15 with the SIM. And for iOS 16 with the cellular, currently this tool is not supported. For that you can try the SMD or iRemove tools or Checkmate. Videos are already on my channel or you can check out the description link. So that is all for this video. I will see you in another one. So till then, goodbye, take care and peace out.